<clears throat> hey guys, welcome back. Hope everybody had a good week. It was a good week here. Pretty good week. Real good week cologne-wise. That might be my bias nostalgia coming through, but it was. <laughs> um, so hope everybody had a good week. Um, hope you're all staying safe. Uh, the holidays are pretty much here. Another couple weeks, we'll all be, not even a couple weeks, really, we're all starting, I'm starting to hear Christmas songs in the, in the stores and on the radios and stuff. Not that I'm in the stores a lot at all, but, uh, I went the other day to get my Christmas shopping done. Like a man, I got it done in an hour. One store. Boom. Thank you, Walmart. <laughs> Uh, it's going to be a different Christmas this year. I'm probably not going to have a huge Christmas haul, um, just because of the whole pandemic thing. Um, not a lot of people are going out shopping. Uh, I haven't really ordered anything online. Uh, <laughs> mom's doing her standard thing of giving me money. So I totally just put it on a prepaid credit card and I'll order some stuff after Christmas get some after Christmas deals yeah so maybe expect an after Christmas haul but I don't expect a Christmas haul this year um which is fine just glad that knock on wood that everybody I love is still still around still healthy hope you guys are all having the same luck I, I really do, guys. I, I joke around on this site a lot and kid around, but I hope everybody is. Be safe, guys. Do what you got to do. Like I said before, I, I you know I only got like a small amount of subscribers, and I'd hate to lose one of these to anything. So, loves you. Um, anyway, enough of the sappy shit. Let's get back on to the man stuff. Mm, man. Smell like a man. Uh, this is what I wore this week. Aspen by Cody. Um, love it. Always have. Um, just gonna get right into the notes and shit, and then we'll talk about it. 1989, Accords are aromatic, woody, fresh, spicy, green, citrus, fresh, lavender, mossy, conifer, that's coniferous, green. <sighs> a lot of Accords. A lot of notes, too. Uh, top is green notes, bergamot, lemon, galbanium, mid is lavender, Juniper, geranium, cyclamine, coriander, orange blossom, jasmine. <laughs> Ooh. Base is balsam fir, cedar, oak moss, musk, and amber. Um, you initially spray this, you're hit with, I'm hit with anyway, the, the citrus. Yeah, I'll give you a spray just to. Decent atomizer for what it is. I mean, it's it's old school cheap, though. No collar, nothing. Just clamp down there. But it's old school cheap. But it's it, it gets the job done. Wide burst. Um, yeah, you definitely pick up on that lemon and bergamot and galbanium and the green notes. Uh, mostly lemon and bergamot off the top with that under, under hinge of green and galbanium and lavender. And they say it's in the mid, but it's pretty much from top to finish. It's it, You've got lavender. Giving it that florally powdery vibe. Um, that top really doesn't last that long. But that's because of the performance of the reformulation. We'll get into that. Um, the mid starts to come into play really about 20 minutes in. So really soon for mid to really take over. Um, and then you're hit with a lot of florals. Still green as hell. Um, just It's really hard to pick out any one floral in there. It's just, it's got a bit of a, a sharpness to it. That would be from the juniper. Um, but it's, you get all the florals mixed together well. The geranium, the cyclamen, the, the, the orange blossom, the jasmine with that lavender mixed together really well. Um, it's still green from the top. I'm still green in the mid um, and somewhat aquatic, but I don't want to say it's because you say aquatic and people are automatically drawn to things like, well, it's, it's bigger brother, cool water, 
um, or things like Aqua Marine by Bulgari or Aqua, all the whole Aqua line by Bulgari, you know, like these aquatics, uh, Nautica stuff. Um, it doesn't give that kind of aquatic vibe. That's more of a trying to hit that ocean, oceanic vibe. Whereas this is more like a wooded spring, you know, an Irish spring. No, no it, 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 it's more of a, like right down the road for me. Um, I live in a city where there's woods all over. It's Canada. Um, and right down, like I mean, 10 minutes down the road. You can get out of your car, walk five minutes in the woods, and there's this beautiful stream of uh, bankments and, and woods and flowers and everything when they bloom in the summer. Um, this time of year, it's great if you like to uh, go watch beavers and um, moose and, and deer. <clears throat> Porcupines are all down by that stream getting... You see the odd bear, too, there. But uh, they're all down there getting a drink, getting ready for the winter. Uh, the beavers got a dam about half a kilometer up ways of that stream. Um, they're fun to watch. They'll work all day. Don't even need a break. God damn it. But, uh, yeah, I like animals, in case you didn't know. I, like, I will literally go to places like that and just sit for hours and watch the animals do their thing. I'm the type of guy that'll sit in the backyard, watch a squirrel in a tree for for half a day. I just think they're great. Um, and that's just so peaceful, sitting by in the middle of the woods. The stream, the brook is just, you hear bubbling and bobbling, going down the rocks and coming to the little falls and the little lake and all the animals. Beautiful. Um, that's what this more gives me a vibe of. Um, artistic impression, though it's not. But that's what I, when I smell it, that's what I think of. Um, and it's beautiful. Um, again, the, and then I should talk about the base. The base does come in and it's definitely green again. Woody, oak, mossy, musky. A, a slight, 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 slight hit of sweetness from the amber, but... It's not a sweet scent by any stretch of the word. Um, it's mostly floral and green and woody. Um, now, performance. This ain't so great. Um, if I'm generous, four and a half, five hours on my skin. But realistically, about three hours, you're going to want to reapply. Luckily, a small bottle, a little 50 mil bottle like this, uh, is luckily like $5. So, it's not hard to reapply. You're not going to break the bank. Jeez, uh, I love that stuff. I get excited for smells and, and they bring me back and, or bring me to places and yeah. Good one. Um, so yeah, the, the longevity, realistically, three hours. Um, the old bottle I have, that I've only got like one, maybe two more uses out of, I've had since high school. I'd spray that stuff up in the morning, uh, go to football after school, take my, you know, take my clothes off, put my football stuff on. <laughs> do football practice or a football game or rugby practice, rugby game, whatever it was at the time, wrestling practice and the wrestling meet, whatever. And I'd come back and put my shirt back on and you could still smell it. Not this stuff. Uh, on my shirt, work shirt this week, I did get about five hours out of it, maybe even six, but it's very weak after about three. Um, and on my skin, realistically, like I said, you can smell it, but you got to really dig in there so i'd say about three hours you might want to reapply but it's cheap so not a big deal um memories with this one a lot like i said high school just uh reminds me of like i said just after school high school football games and parties and rugby games and wrestling meets things like that um I first smelled it. I do remember when I first smelled it. My friend got it. 
who lived across the street. Uh, he was kind of into colognes, more than me at the time, really. Um, he had a mother, I don't want to say spoil them, but she would go out and buy him a $150 bottle of cologne, whereas most of us were rocking preferred stock. But she got him this because he liked this. And uh, I remember wearing it the first time I wore it in high school. I got uh, a lot of the girls, you know, really liked it. And that's what I'm going to say about this DNA. The, 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 think about it's Brig Brothers, Cool Water, um, Green Irish Tweed. Uh, and I guess it's Younger Brothers, uh, Trey Nui, Trey Ball from our moth, uh, even to a lesser extent, uh, the La Parfait by the Moff. This DNA works well with women uh, of any age. They like it. It's a pleasant smell. It's not. You, you can look at any YouTube video if you think I'm lying where they review this, especially if it's a woman or if they have a woman on there. They always pick this as one of their favorites. It's just that smell they like. It's manly but not overly aggressively manly it's somewhat i don't want to say seductive that's the wrong word it's not mysterious or dark or, but it does have somewhat of a a casual seductive type vibe to it that dna um yeah it's a nice scent um compliments i got four of them this week wearing this pretty much one a day um so not bad. And again, it ran the gamut of ages from teenage girls to girls getting ready to retire. <clears throat> and everything in between. It, every one of them said it was a nice scent. Um, didn't knock anybody's socks off, but that's not what it's this type of, like I said, that DNA does for some reason. It's just really pleasant to them. Um, yeah, I just, I love Aspen. Anyway, I was saying my friend bought it and uh, I wore it and uh, he liked it, but he had a dozen different colognes, and I only had, like, two. And uh, he said, well, you know, he liked it, but he wasn't his favorite. And sat on his shelf for, like, two months. He never wore it. I said, dude, are you going to wear that? And he was like, uh, sometime, maybe. And I said, well, let me have it. We had that kind of friendship. We were best friends. You know, like, we lived in the same neighborhood, went to the same school since elementary all the way up to high school. Um... He said, yeah, take it. He goes, I don't know. Says, if I want it again, I'll get mom to get it for me. You know, it was like 10 bucks at the time or whatever it was. Like, All right, cool. So that was my first bottle that I still have. Hold on, I'll show you. I mean, look at this thing from years. It's got dust on it. <laughs> it's still got the same damn atomizer, though. <laughs> we can't really... But you see, this is a different bottle. It's more of the shape of the cool water bottle. This, this one here. And it's got the uh, cap with aspirin written on it, the metal cap. A little better bottle. It's got that cool water shape. Um, like I said, people say this is a clone of Green Irish Tweed. As you can see, I've got very little left. <laughs> um, I say no, it isn't. I say it's a clone of Cool Water. I think they cloned Cool Water, not knowing that Cool Water kind of copied Green Irish Tweed. So this is more similarities to Green Irish Tweed, though, than to Cool Water, I think. Or sorry, strike that. I meant the other way. This has more similarities to uh, Cool Water than, than Green Irish Tweed. It's not as aquatic as Cool Water, but it's not as green as Green Irish Tweed. Um, kind of falls in the, in the middle so if Green Irish Tweed is just a little too green for you, or if Cool Water is a little too aquatic, this might be your 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 go your go to. Um, just a nice scent, guys. Just a nice scent. Um, I wish they didn't mess with the formulation because this is the stuff that lasted all day. This not so much. Um, but still, for the price, like I said, you can pick up this bottle here for like five bucks. I mean. <laughs> Can't really complain about that. Um, as I said, the, the 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 elephant in the room is the green Irish tweed comparison, which yes, very much so. Is it a replacement for green Irish tweed? No, of course. If you can afford green Irish tweed, 
Um, it's a little, it is a little more high quality, not going to lie, of course. Uh, but this ain't that far off, honestly. And for the price, it's ridiculous. Girls like it. You can wear it anywhere, any time of the year. The hottest summer day, maybe not. And the coldest winter day, maybe not. Because it might not be strong enough to cut through that, that, that cold, cold winter again. But we all... People say that, like, we're standing outside all the time. No. Most of us are in climate-controlled environments at home, at work, at friends' houses, malls. Well, we're not in a whole lot of malls now. But you know what I'm saying. So you can, yeah, you can wear it all day. Any day, any time. Um... Just a lovely sense. I don't got much more to say about it. Um, ask, you know, purchase it, purchase. It's it's worth the five bucks, guys. Honestly, it's not even a try or just buy it. It's five, ten dollars. You'll thank me later. It's a beautiful scent. You said you'll have to reapply. But that's okay at the price point. Not a big deal. So that's it, guys. I'll be back in a minute. I bought one that I kind of want to talk about because it would surprise me. Really much so. So I'll be back with that. Peace. Love. Be good to each other.